Let's talk about the newborn hearing screening. Many parents may not realize that their baby's hearing is tested in the hospital. I know I wasn't aware of that when both of my babies were born. Can you walk us through what the test involves and what parents can expect during this process? Absolutely. It's amazing that today, within hours of birth, your baby's hearing is going to be screened. And it's so important that it's going to be screened before you even leave the hospital. The good thing is, is that it's a test your baby gets to sleep through. It's gentle. I'm curious, Melissa, did your, your babies, were they screened in your room or in the nursery? They were screened in the nursery, but they came back with on their bassinet a little sticker that said they had their first hearing screening. So I'm so curious what it actually looks like since I didn't get to witness it. So there's two tests that are used uh, typically for screening, and one is called an otoacoustic emission or OAE test, and the other is an auditory brainstem response test or ABR. Interesting, what's the difference? For an OAE screening, they put a little microphone in your baby's ear and a little headphone. They play sounds and the cochlea or the inner ear plays an echo back and that microphone measures that echo back. The other test, the ABR, there's a sensor that's placed on your baby's head and then there's sounds that are played and that sensor measures your baby's brain response to sound. So it's terrific that we can have that within days of birth. It's important for you to know the results and uh, to follow up urgently should your baby refer or not pass their hearing screening.